Hi team, um, a quick update on what's going on. We don't have any horses racing this weekend, um, but we have some exciting Kiwis going uh, racing at Randwick on Saturday. And of course, we've got really some great racing on at Mooney Valley tomorrow. Um, mm. One of my favorite horses is racing at Randwick, which is who shot the barman. So um, I look forward to seeing him. He's one of uh, my favorites. Um, well, we had a couple of horses that uh, are uh, moving around. We've got Emma Lavita who left the other day and got up to Logan Racing and she has already been claimed by a rider, rider up there who said that nobody else can ride her um, and um, you yeah, know he just wants to ride her so that's a good thing. She's already loved up there which is that's that's great. So um, they're, they're quite happy about that because obviously it's a good rider and he's claimed her for himself. Um, and we've got um, the Sham Express Lady Desheen Philly that's um, She's thank you everybody that she's full. Um, we've had a last minute rush for her and um, now she, I cannot take anybody in for her syndication. So um, she is ready to go up to Logan Racing, just organising with Majestic. Um, and hopefully she'll head up next week, middle of next week. But I will keep you updated. Um, she's looking amazing. She's such a big, strong filly and she really needs to hit out on that on that sand up there that they, they gallop on the beach. And uh, and um, so, yeah, she's, she, she really needs to get up there and do some work. Um, she'll be, she'll be just quite a different type of horse than Emma Lavita. They're two different types of fillies and um, really both quite exciting. So uh, I look forward, I've looked forward to them hitting, hitting their straps. Um, other than that, we've got, of course, next weekend we've got um, the Group 1 Livermore and uh, Dance 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 is heading towards that. All reports are great coming out of that camp. And um, Los Angeles will be heading down there too with Trudy Thornton booked to ride her. Um, and um, possibly Ruby Armani. Uh, we're just waiting to see if uh, what sort of field she gets, uh, if it's a stronger field in Hawera, which is another option the following, following week after that, or um, she's better off to stay at the, in, the, in the group three at the, in the Red Bridge Sprint. Um, at, uh, uh, we'll just have to wait and see what the fields are like. Um, so yeah, so, so could be quite a busy day on the October the 6th down there, but I tell you what, it's gonna be hat day and high heel day, and hopefully it's a, a beautiful day, it usually is. Um, so I'm, I'm looking forward to that. Um, so that, you know, the horses that are coming through uh, for spring and summer are exciting. As I said, we've still got Sip and Wolf, we've still got Hot and High Heels, and um, you know, the, the, the two-year-old's always exciting because you never know what you're gonna get. So I'm um, really happy with um, what we've got going on, and I will keep you updated with um, more for the future. And um, other than that, enjoy your day, enjoy your weekend, and that's Backs on Track.